Every 20 seconds, a child dies because of water-related diseases, such as cholera and typhoid. The majority of diseases are due to fecal matter within the water, and transmission occurs by drinking contaminated water. You can make water cleaner and ready to drink by using this simple two-step process at home. The first step is cloth filtration. Take a large cloth, which you'll need to fold at least four times so there are multiple layers of fabric. Once folded, it needs to cover the opening of a storage vessel easily. Fasten the cloth, securing it around the rim of the opening, and tighten with a string. Filter all water immediately at the place where you're collecting it. Gather the water, let it settle, then pour off the clear water on top. Once you've filtered the water, seal the container securely and keep it separate from the unfiltered water. If you're going to reuse the cloth, always make sure the same side is up each time. Rinse the filter cloth after each use and wash with soap if available. Make sure your final rinse uses cloth filtered water. This cloth method can be used on its own, but it's better if it's used in combination with the power of the sun. Step two, take a plastic bottle, like a soft drink bottle. Remove its label. The bottle must be clean, unbroken, transparent, colorless, or with a bluish tint, and it must be smaller than three liters. Pour the water you've collected into it, but only fill it two-thirds of the way. Tighten the cap and shake for about 20 seconds. Fill it to the top and put it on the roof of your house. Fully expose the bottle to sunlight from morning to evening for at least six hours. The sun will destroy the germs that cause disease. If the sky is cloudy, the bottle needs to remain in the sun for two days in a row. The water is now ready to drink, but you need to keep the water in the same bottle you used. Here's to your health!